Hey guys, welcome or welcome back. I am very excited because today I'm going to be unboxing some PR, but like not really today, like this whole week because we are doing a week of PR unboxing and you might be like, what does that mean? Well, I am really impatient. Like before I've done videos where it's like the PR I've collected over the past two weeks or week or whatever and I just like collected the PR and then I did it. Well, let me just tell you guys, I am way too impatient for that. Like that was like a lot of a lot of I took a lot to do that but um I could do it now because what we're gonna be doing is every single day that I get PR so if I don't get PR that week then I'll tell you guys but basically it's gonna be like Monday Tuesday the days of the week I hope that you guys know them um but yeah so I already have one PR package today and that was like my inspiration for this video because I was like I'm so excited I need this right now and then I was like no save it and we're gonna do a PR video and I was like there's no way. So I thought of this just so I could open them up right now and I could open the rest as I get them. So I'm very excited. I actually have like, don't really know what I'm getting. I, but I'm very excited for this one because recently I had freeze dried candy and it's like the best thing ever. I mean, I've had it a couple of times, but let's just say I like pretty much finished it all. Maybe I have like one airhead left, but right now I don't like, be very cool to try. I have more free dry candy, but this box is giant. So we're gonna open it. Let's go. Look how big this package is, and this is full of free dry candy. And how I know, fragile. The, the, the sticker's a little ripped because I took off my address so you guys don't show up. Um. Anyways, we're gonna unbox this. This is like huge. I got it, mom. I almost just cut my face. That would have not been good. Okay, uh, this box is genuinely huge, but this is from Crunch a Bunch Candies, which they have really, like, they have some good candy on there. A lot of freeze dried candy. And I am so excited. I think that the person that, um, the person that makes it was so nice. Like, literally, she was so sweet. Mom, could you help me? I cannot do this. A big package. I don't got a big muscles for that. But anyways, my mom does. She works out like every day. So I am so excited. I can't even. She let me pick out so many candies and she said that she even threw in some extra ones for me. So I know like what some of them are, but then there's like a couple that are extras that she just tossed in for me to also try. So I cannot wait. Okay. Is there a line? Oh my god. My mom's face, she just went, let's see, oh, this is giant, look at how, you can tell, there's a lot in there, oh my god, thank you girl, we got a little note first of all, oh, this shows everything that's inside, we're not gonna look, because I kind of forgot some of it, well, no, I remember some of it, I thought this was, like, a business card, okay, oh my god, whoa, whoa, it just, whoa, Oh my god. Guys, okay, so each of these whoa, whoa, wozers. Wozers. Each of these little things have like two in each. Whoa! Okay, I am uh, jaws dropped in shock. What even are these? Lemon heads. Ooh, it says it on them, I like that. What should I even try? In here we have fruit roll up. I wanted to try those. These look really interesting. We have tarty parties, which are, oh my god, they're like the little tart bites. Okay, guys, I'm not gonna try every single candy covers. I know, I, I got two of those, Mom. Nerds clusters, which these are the best candies ever. And you guys, these bags are huge. You guys should, okay, I was looking at our website, and I was shocked, because free shirt candy is so expensive, like, normally bags like this would be more, like, they would be, like, 20 bucks, but hers were 10 bucks for a big bag, and I know that 10 bucks is a little expensive candy, but if you see the other prices on free dried candy, you would be surprised, because other free dried candies are so expensive, literally, so I am, okay, we're gonna open all these up, mom, help me, I, I can't even... I didn't even know what's in here. 
uh, freeze dried Laffy Taffy. She sent a lot of extra stuff. This is this is wild, y'all. Airheads. Yeah, those are uh, lemon heads. More. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Jolly Ranchers. I love me some Jolly Ranchers. Love me some Jolly Alleys. So I'm gonna try the rest of them in YouTube Shorts because there it's gonna be like multiple parts of YouTube Shorts because really, yeah, this is a lot, and I've never been happier. This might just be the most exciting PR of the video. It probably will be. Oh my god. More than two bags of- Four bags of- Nerds! I've actually had these before. I think I've had them before. Yeah, but I've only had like so little. Like the teeniest little bit. Like half of this. And this is the mini bag. But look at the big bag! Oh my god. Okay. I- What do I even try? This is actually- I'm actually shocked! This part of the video- Okay. Monday's gotten some good PR. I'm so happy. Starting off the week. Perfect. Okay. What do I even... Okay. Let me just go over everything that I got. And I... There's so many things that I want to try right now. I'm probably going to try like two or three things. But I don't know. Because this is all so exciting. Okay. Starburst. I did not order these. So she also put these in for me. Oh my god. Okay. So these are... Yeah. Starburst. These are like the half and half flavors. It does not look like Starburst. But they are. Fruit roll-ups, which is really exciting. Have you guys seen the fruit roll-up ice, ice cream trend? That's so cool. A lot of bubble wrap, you guys. Look at this giant stack of bubble wrap. Okay, never mind. Oh, actually, yeah. A lot of bubble wrap. A lot of protection for the candies, because these are very fragile, y'all. Airheads. I also... I don't know if I ordered these. I don't think that I did. I think that these are freebies as well. Yep. Yep, I do that. I'm so happy. Okay, yeah. Airheads, so exciting. Sweet tarts, which these are such so good. Oh my god, you guys, look at the back. From the freeze dried kitchen. So cool. Once again, this is from Crunch a Bunch Candy. Cr Crunch a Bunch of Crunch a Bunch of Candy. And I will link their Instagram like in the description. I will link all these brands like Instagrams and stuff. But this is amazing. I love these so much. Am I the only one that's like obsessed with these? Like on Halloween, I pray that I get a few bags of these. Last year I didn't. But this makes up for it. Laffy Taffy. This is like all the can. Oh my god. You guys have no idea how exciting this is to me. Lemon heads. I actually have I even had regular lemon heads. I don't even think so. So that's gonna be double new to me because free tried and something I've never tried. Uh, Jolly Ranchers, which I have tried a few of these, and oh my god. They're so bustin'. I still say bustin'. I don't know about you guys, but like, bustin' is just such a good word, y'all. Blue Jolly Ranchers. Oh my god, nerds. Nerds clusters. Guess what? Nerds clusters. And for the finale, nerds clusters. But wait, there's more. Not more nerds clusters, but more candy. And I don't think I need any more nerds clusters because that's a lot of nerds clusters. And I like nerds clusters. Watermelon Dolly Ranchers. Have you guys ever seen me this happy? Milk Duds. Oh my god, I actually thought of... It's almost like Milk Dudes. Oh, maybe it is Milk Dudes. I don't know. I haven't really... I don't... Maybe I had, like, Milk Duds, like, once, the regular ones. I've never had the freeze dried ones, because I've only had, like, the regular ones. And, oh my god, I'm actually so excited for these. freeze dried Peeps, but not any Peeps. Cotton Candy Peeps. <laughs> what do I try? Okay. I definitely want to try some peepities. And I want to try... Oh my god, this is really, like, crazy. <laughs> oh my lord. Okay, I probably want to try fruit roll-ups. I'm not going to try the lemon heads again. Like, but, like, you guys. After this is posted, probably, like, all the shorts will be up. And, like, you guys will get to see me try them. Starburst. Probably not going to try these yet. I kind of want to try the sweet tarts. Oh, this is so cool. Okay, I think I'm going to try the Milk Duds, though. Okay, so this is what we're going to try right now. Maybe I'll try the Nerds Clusters as well. Cotton Candy Peeps, Milk Duds, and Fruit Roll-Ups. What should I even start off with? I think I should end with Milk Duds because that's like chocolate, so it's like very different. Let's start with these Peeps. I'm actually, I'm, I'm dying. Thank you so much, Crunch a Bunch Candy. Crunch a Bunch of, I'm sorry. It's a little tongue twister, but thank you so much, Crunch a Bunch of Candy. I... Love it. And also, that name is so amazing. Crunch a bunch of candy. That's so cute. Okay. How do I even open this? I love Cotton Kitty Peeps. Like, I don't have Peeps much, but, like, if I ever got to pick Peeps. Of 
course, the ideal flavor to pick is cotton candy. Like, hello? These pretty much look the same as my regular peeps, except for peeps are very smushy. These are hard as a rock. Not very as a rock. Fragile. Okay. Are you guys ready? Okay, let's try. I have my little mic, so I'm going to take it off just for this. I'm going to try to not turn it off, though. That would really suck if I just turned it off. Okay, hopefully it doesn't turn off. It's not going to. Oh my god. You guys need to try these. These just like are lucky charms. But cotton candy flavored, which like cotton candy plus lucky charms, like what else could you want? These are so good. It feels like I'm eating styrofoam, which like that isn't the best way possible because who does not want to eat styrofoam? Guys, if there's, like, weird, like, cravings that you want to eat, like, random stuff, like, I've heard people say that they want to eat, like, drywall or, like, I don't know, some weird stuff. Or if you want to eat, like, styrofoam, which styrofoam looks like it would be so yummy and crunchy. This is the perfect substitute, and it tastes amazing, like, a mix of mm, Lucky Charms and cotton candy. Okay. I'm in love. It's tomorrow. Amazing. I love it. I'll link her shop and her everything in her. I'm pretty sure that she has TikTok, so if she does, I'll link it. Oh my god. I actually. I'm so obsessed with Freezer I can, you guys. This? really intrigued me free dried fruit roll-ups by the way you guys she literally sent me like one of every single thing on her site i mean not exactly one because i got three dollar rancher bags and four nerds cluster which are probably going to be the best ones because i've tried them before and i was obsessed but i ran out really fast because i just need a little bit that's what they look like very cool i've seen the like fruit roll-ups and ice cream chat on tiktok and i want to try it but like i don't know i haven't bought them yet but we have freeze-dried fruit roll-ups but i'm not going to do the ice cream time with these because you gotta like put it inside but let's try this i'm so excited okay mm. the texture is not what i imagined but the texture is so good on these like hello these taste really good too These are so good to snack on. Wait, these are so good. I'm gonna look to see, like, these are the tattoo version. I'm gonna try and, like, eat them all right now, you guys. Seriously, these are amazing. Top tier. I didn't think that I liked these much. I mean, no. I knew that I liked these, but I didn't think that I, like, liked them this much. This is really good. Because I don't... A lot of people, like, say, like, oh my god, I've been having, like, fruit up since I'm little. Like, I've always, like... My parents, like, always bought them, and I, like, grew up with them. I did not. Like, when I was, like, 10, I had my first fruit roll-up, and that was, like, from my friends. Like, my parents didn't even buy it. Now, my mom buys fruit roll-ups once in a while for my brother, not for me. Well, I could have it if I want, but I don't normally grab for them, but freeze-dried ones are a different level, you guys. They're a little, like, sour and somehow. These are milk tuds. These are probably the last one I'm going to try, but... I don't know. These are so good. I don't know. Okay. Milk duds. This is taking up a very long time of the video, but like, this video might be long because this is so cool. Mmm. Oh my god, they're so soft. Never even had milk duds. Well, like, a very long time ago I did once, like I said. This is good. The chocolate flavor is really good. Maybe this is like caramel. These are so easy to eat. I could just like one little smash and they'd like turn into fine dust because they're so. Look at that. Mmm. That was really good.
I'm obsessed. Okay, I'm done. I cannot eat anymore. I wish I could, but I don't want to eat all of these. I definitely have room in my belly because these are delicious. I, I will have room for this at any time, but I'm stuck with my teeth. <laughs> I'm gonna try one more thing. Which is gonna be. I want to do the nerd clusters. Now I have chocolate in my teeth though. I'm thinking it might not be the best mix, but oh well. This is like really scrumptious. I, I, I could eat this in a whole day if I wanted to. I won't. Well, actually, like, you know, probably realistically, I will finish these in like maybe like a two weeks. Which. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe less. Just depends on how I'm feeling. Okay? So. This looks so good. Mm. This is the, like, smaller bag. Big bag. I love Nerds Gone Clusters, so. I knew I'm gonna love these. Bags that she even said, like a lot. I'm shocked to doodled. So good. They're like a little sour, which I love sour stuff. I love sour stuff. Those are really good. Okay. I cannot even. I'm taking way too long for the free dry candy section, but like, come on. This is amazing. Like, this girl is so sweet. Crunch a bunch of candy. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much. And you guys, make sure to go support them because as I said, these are like the best deals that I've seen for free dried candy so far. A while ago, I was trying to buy free dried candy. And um, I, I bought it. And like a bag this big was like $25 on the thing that I was buying. And I was like looking for the best deal, y'all. And that was like the best deal. And I was like, what? Why are these so expensive? But to be honest, I wish that I found this earlier because I would have totally bought in a ton because I could buy like two and a half bags, but I spent it all on one. And guess what? I didn't even spend it on that good of a candy. It was like, I don't forgot what it was. It was Laffy Taffy, but a weird Laffy Taffy. This Laffy Taffy is good. I've had this one. It was like a weird Laffy Taffy. It was like Coca-Cola Laffy Taffy because it was the only thing that they had in stock. Guys, learn from me buy from her because i'm not even kidding i would definitely buy from this if i just stumbled upon it and i was looking for free dried candy i'd be like oh, yes thank you bunch of crunch crunch a bunch of candy it's a little bit of a tongue twister but yeah that is it um for monday and i will see you guys but once again gotta link all of her stuff in the bio and i am just so happy and make sure to wait for the rest because i'm gonna try it in youtube shorts See you guys Tuesday. And I can't wait to see what I get if I get something. Hey guys, we are on day two and I have three more packages today. I just came back from school, um, so I'm really excited. I am exhausted and I was gonna take a nap, but then these came and I'm like, okay, let's open them up. So these are the ones that we have. I already took this out of the box because it I didn't know what it was. So I had to take it out to make sure. And then we have this. This is from Hardy Beauty, which I'm actually so excited for. It's a makeup brand. And I saw them on Instagram. And I was like, oh my god, this is the cutest thing ever. So I was like, yes, I literally need to try this out. So, um, yeah, now here we are. They sent me over some goodies to try. So I'm very excited. I'm especially excited for their blush. And their packaging is so adorable. So, yeah, thank you, Hardy Beauty. And now let's open it up. I'm going to try out their blushes. I think that we have five things in here very exciting um pretty sure that what they're most known for though is like the awesome blushes that they have the colors are really pretty and i decided to try out some new colors that i wouldn't normally try out so it's going to be a little bit of a step I, I think i got like a red blush in here which is a little bit crazy but that's how it looks in here i'm just gonna pull out something like this okay oh this is a highlighter so i ordered a gel highlight i love how they all come Almost like a little small business. They all come packaged up like this. So this is their gel highlighter. Wow. <gasps> okay, pretty. I got... It doesn't have a logo on it, but... 
Okay, I got this like rose gold shade. That's really cool. I'm not going to try it yet. I'm going to try it on top of the blushes. Awesome. I want to smell it. I smell everything, you guys. It actually smells good. It smells like perfume. This smells good. Okay, I can't wait to try that. I ordered three blushes and I only have two cheeks. So, uh, I am not going to be able to try out one of them, I think. Oh my god, they're so tiny. These are cream blushes. These are so cute. Look at how cute this is. This is, uh... It just says eight. Okay, wait. Guys, the blushes are in the cutest little packaging. Are you ready? I thought that it would be bigger. These are so adorable. They're so good for on the go. You guys, look at that. Very cutie. Okay. Oh, cute. Okay, I think that this is... This is the shade eight. I think that this is like the peachy one. Very cool. I like this. My mom... I feel like my mom would like this shade. It's like kind of like a peachy nude pretty and it has like a little mirror as well these are so cute for on the go and they're so tiny and adorable okay i love that by the way guys their makeup is pretty affordable like their blushes are like 10 bucks and they're so cute and the formula looks really good as well just like a very cute like cream blush so i don't really i don't think i have any cream blushes actually i know i have a few liquid ones i have powder ones cream blushes though i actually know the milk makeup stick pretty sure that that's a cream blush I don't know, this is the shade 7. It doesn't have names. On the website, it had names, though. I, I got a pink one, a red one, and I think that the one that I just opened a second ago was the peachy one. If I could get this open, I would be able to show you guys the shade. Hopefully this is the red one, because I really want to try out the red one. Okay. I also ordered a lipstick from them, because they had some really pretty shades of lipstick. I ordered, like, a pinkish shade. Here we go. Oh, okay. So... The, like, a little outside, I think, like, matches with the color inside. So, this is the red one, I think. Probably, because the packaging is red. Okay. Let's see the reveal. Oh, my God. Okay, I think this is very pretty. I have a link to their website down below and their, like, socials and stuff. So, you guys can go check them out and look at their website. Because they have some really cute stuff. What is this? I think this is a little note. Oh! Cool. Okay, and then, wow, they sent me a lot of coupon codes. Okay, and then, oh, this is another blush. Oh, they sent, like, extra stuff along, you guys. I ordered, they sent me th five things to pick out, and I, there's more than five things in here. Let's see what else they sent. I know that this is probably another blush because it's the same packaging yep okay this should be the pink one this is the shade one i'm actually so excited for the pink one i love baby pink blushes and i also had like oh this one might be the peach one. Oh yeah i think this is the peach one i thought the other one was the peach one. Oh, that's pretty it's very nude very cool color so then this is the like they're like pinky one I think I'm going to try out the pink and the red. Hold on a minute. Hold on a second. My nails are not, my nails are quite, okay, I don't want to break my nail, but they're not even hard to open. I just like have struggling opening things. Have you guys seen me opening things on camera? That's why I decided to finally get a knife cutter. Okay, we're going to open that in a second. I just got that open like two seconds ago. Oh, oh my god, they sent me little samples of their face wash powder. You know, that's so funny because I actually wanted to try this. You guys, these are little samples of the orders. That's so cute. So this is a, I, I don't know how to pronounce it. I think it's like, I don't know, but it's like this face wash powder that's like really good for your skin. And I actually wanted to get it, but I didn't. Voca face wash powder. But look, they're like little like one use thingies. And you guys, they sent me little freebies. How did they know that I wanted this? And then this is the lipstick that I ordered see how we open this one up i can't wait to try on this shade this is gonna be really pretty yes i am making a huge mess okay you guys hearted beauty lipstick Ooh, cute bottle oh, it's in the shape of a heart oh my god the shade is cool guys let's try it 
it's in the shape of a heart that's so cute literally look love their packaging mm. oh it's so like such a like creamy formula I'm using my mirror oops it's really like creamy and pretty very cute I like that and then oh my god look a little heart beauty blender and a um a hair tie in here very cute they probably i think that they send these with all the orders i love beauty blenders you could always use a new beauty blender um perfect to blend out the little blushes that i got but i already brought my own beauty blender here because i didn't know that they would come with this that's really cool though um so i am not sure whether i should blend these out with like a sponge or a brush but i think i want to start off with brush i already put on the lipstick as you guys saw i really like this shade actually It's pretty. And let's try it with a brush, actually. Okay. I think... Okay, we're going to do one side. I just want to try the red blush, actually. Let's try the red blush. Okay. There we go. Okay. Pretty. Now let's go like this. Try to grab some product. These are so adorable and tiny. I love... Okay. I don't think I got any on there. Hold on. Let's try to use it with my finger. Ooh, that color looks really pretty on my finger. I I feel like this is going to be very pigmented, so I'm a little bit scared. Um, I don't know what brush. Maybe maybe a beauty blender. These are perfect on the go cuz look, you could send I mean, you could take the little uh, baggie that they give you. You can put your little blush in there and have the little sponge that they give you. It's very cute. That's cute. Look at that. Adorable. Let's put it on my other side. Or I'm going to put it a little more over here just to layer a little. It's a very pretty color. I wasn't sure if I would like red blush on me, but I've been trying it at my friend's house because my friends have some red blushes. I was like, oh, this is like, it looks pretty good on me. So I was like, I'll test it out from Hearted Beauty. Very cute. And you guys, um, the way that they spell Hearted is they do Heart and D Beauty. So it's not like Hearted with an E, it's Hearted. I don't know, I'll put it down below if you guys didn't get that. But. So cute. I like the shade. Okay, let's try the pink one on the other side. Or we could try the pink one on my nose. That's how it's looking. Let's try it on my nose a little. Oh, wow. This is actually really... Look. I like this color a lot. Very natural. It looks like it's going to be... Okay, wait. Let's put it over here, not over there. Never used a cream blush, so I'm not exactly sure how to, like, work with it. Because my Milk Makeup one, I really use it, like, rarely. Like, I never use it. I've only used it, like, a few times, like, actually out. Guys, okay, which shade do you like more on me? The pink shade, hold on, or the red shade? I don't know which one I like. I kind of like, I mean, I already knew that pink shade's like, I like a lot. But I don't know. I feel like the pink one might be better for me, but we're just going to put some more red on top so that we could not have mismatched cheeks. Very cute. I like these blushes, and I love how affordable they are for, like, such a cute thing. Like, look at how adorable that is. These are seriously the most cute blushes ever. And they come with a little mirror that are adorable. Like, look. And this mirror looks tiny, but to be honest, it's like, shows your cheek, like, perfectly. <laughs> How do I explain that? It, like, it's like the perfect little angle to show your cheek. Or I'll be in the lipstick a little better. Okay. That's cute. I like it. Adorable. And then let's try out this rose gold highlighter. I was really debating between the rose gold highlighter and their white one. But I was like, you know what? I already have a few white highlighters. Let's try out something rose gold. So I'm honestly a bit scared. It's a little dark on me. Not sure if this is the correct one for my skin tone, but like champagne color. Okay. I also don't know what I should blend this out with. I think we're gonna go with 
I have this highlighter brush, which you're probably not supposed to. Okay, yeah, you're not supposed to blend it with that. That's for sure. Let's try it with this. Or with our finger. Oh, this one's so pretty for your nose. Guys, look at my nose right now. That actually looks so good on my nose. Like the tip of my nose. That's really cute. I would probably get a different shade in this one um next time like if you have a similar skin tone to mine i would probably recommend like the whiter shade because yeah but cute i like this brand a lot their stuff is very cute and affordable and i would definitely check them out and they're like the most cutest thing like for valentine's day a little gift i know the valentine's day just passed but like you always got next Valentine's Day or any type of gift just to express your love for like your bestie or something. Very cute. Let's add a little more of this red blush. It's like the perfect amount of pigment in here, I feel like. And the color, it just like, the color of the red blush just looks like juicy. Like, I don't know. It just like, I don't know. It looks good. I like it. Um, and then the two other packages that I have, you guys, that was everything in that one. I am so grateful. So thank you so much, Hearted Beauty. I love these. These are so adorable. Definitely go check them out. And I think if there is a discount code that they gave me, I forgot if they did, but I will go check. And if there is, I will put it in the description so that maybe you guys have a little discount code to check out. And yeah, so if you want to buy anything, go check my description first. See if I have a discount code for you guys there. Okay, anyways, now on to the next package. Again, thank you so much, Hardy Beauty. Love this. Love this. Love this. So cute. And I love the little samples. That is so sweet. And these little powder thingies are actually like this might force me to double cleanse because I actually need to start double cleansing. Um my double cleansing has not I have not been doing it, okay? Because like I don't know. These next two packages are cool. They're from the same Amazon seller. And I will put her like Amazon front linked in the bio and these products linked and stuff. So the first thing we have in here is a cooling pillowcase these are not beauty but these are like more like home types of things uh where's my cutter thing here it is my little cloud cutter more like oh wait it doesn't, it's a zip log how smart am i so i've actually gotten from the same seller a little cooling blanket which is so nice it's so like cooling um and i like this cooling pillowcase because you guys who doesn't want a cold pillowcase? Like, you know when you're, like, on your pillowcase and you have to keep on flipping it because it's not, like, cold enough? Everybody loves a cold pillowcase. This one is cold all over. I can already feel it, like, even through the bag, I can feel it, like, cooling. And, ooh, I'm not even sure how these work, but it's really cool to me. And this presentation is so cute. Inside, it's, like, more cold. Oh, my God. This is actually, like, really nice. Like, if I put my hands inside, it's, like, really cold. Guys, I love this. Right now, I have a silk pillowcase, but this one's, like, also... I use a silk pillowcase because they're, like, good for your skin. But this is, like, feels like silk. And I feel like it would be good for your skin as well. Very nice. Okay, very cooling. I actually wasn't expecting to be that cold. It's very nice. And I will put the link to this product down below as well as a discount code. I'm pretty sure that this seller did give a discount code for you guys. So if you want to check this out, definitely do. Because who wants to flip their pillow all night while they're trying to sleep? Not me. But I am very excited to use this tonight. Thank you so much. Um, now the next box, like I said, from the same seller. This is a shower caddy. And this is really cool because it's a shower caddy. Like, you could store all of your things in there. I want to see what it looks like because you basically just, like, hook it on the wall of your shower. Then it, like, can store everything. Yeah. It didn't break. It's sturdy okay whoa this quad is nice it's like heavy okay here we are it's actually like really nice quality and there's actually a lot more room in here that i would think okay so there's these little things to like attach it i think and then you can put all your stuff in here okay sorry about that little intermission i had to pause the video real quick um but yes yeah, so this is the shower caddy super adorable i'm gonna hold all my body 
washes and um, like shampoos, conditioners in here. I just actually bought some new body washes and I don't have room for them. This is perfect because you just hook this on your wall and you're ready to go. You have extra room because some showers don't have any room. Like my shower has a lot of room, but I have so many shower products, you guys. Like it's a lot. Okay, and I don't have room for all that, so I'm actually really happy that they sent over the shower caddy because now I could have more space to hold other things that I impulsively buy. Yeah, okay, that is that for today's PR, but I will see you guys the next day. Hi guys, it is day three of unboxing PR, and I'm going to try to start making the videos a little bit shorter because I just realized that all these videos have been like 10-15 minutes each, and I cannot do that, so I'm going to try to make this like five minutes right now which might be a little bit difficult because, you guys, I have things that I've ordered and gotten in PR, and I know that I'm not supposed to show things that I ordered, but, like, I was just, like, too excited, so I think I need to show you guys because they're all beauty-related, and, like, like, I need more beauty. But, like, still, and then I will also show you guys the PR. So, let's start off with what I ordered, and I'm going to be very fast, y'all, so try and keep... I'm going to try, okay? I'm probably... I'm going to try my hardest. So, first, I got this plump, plump hyaluronic cream from Glow Recipe. I got this to, like, match with the serum that I have from them. I really like that serum, and it, like, goes together. But, you guys, look at how little product this is. Like, I just got this yesterday, and look, I haven't even used it yet. And look at how much product came in it, and look at how, like, little the pot is. But the packaging is so cute, so. Okay, and this is the biggest size available, you guys. It was, like, 30-something bucks. Anyways, so. Yeah, I'm excited to try out that because I'm obsessed with Glorespi. I have, like, so much of their stuff. I have all their serums, a lot of their stuff in Glorespi. Like, I love you. Okay? Um, so now, let me show you guys my Amazon order. You guys have probably seen these on TikTok. These are, like, the peel-off lip tints. We have the shade uh, Cherry Red, Sexy Red, Rose Pink, uh, Sweet Orange. Scared for that one. It's literally orange. I, I'm already wearing one of them, by the way. I am wearing this one, Lovely Peach. Not very peachy, but still looks great it's a little splotchy in some areas but it just like depends on how you apply it yeah you can kind of see it's like a little weird and then we have watermelon which this one smells like watermelon jolly ranchers watermelon jolly rancher like sour haired jolly ranchers that's how it smells like you know like warheads like if warheads did a collab with jolly ranchers and you tried the watermelon flavor that's how it would be now time for my sephora order real quick i'm very excited for this one so First, I got this Rare Beauty Tinted um, Moisturizer Sample Card, and look at that. I'm not sure if any of those will be my shade, but oh well. Then we have this NARS Concealer Sample Thingy, which I actually wanted to try this concealer, so can't wait to try that. Hope that my shade's in there. And speaking of concealers, the thing that I ordered is this Dior Backstage Concealer, and I'm very excited. I'm not exactly sure if it's my shade. kind of looks like a little too, I don't know, yellow in a way? Like... Maybe it's just, like, me and I, like, I don't know, you guys. Hold on, I gotta get it. It just fell on the floor. The packaging is so cute, though, and this Dior concealer is 29 bucks, and then the other one is 40 bucks. I mean, I get it. There's more product than the other one, but still. Okay. Yeah, that is that. That's what I got. I got the shade 1N. I don't know. And then, as a free gift, I was actually so excited about this because I've been wanting to try Merit products for a while, especially their, like, flush brush, flush blush, it's called. Um, so when I saw that they were giving out, like, free trial size of it for a $25 order, I was like, oh my god, yes. And this shade might look intimidating, which at first I was like, hell no, there's no way. Like, that's kind of, not hell no, but I was like, I would much rather have another shade. But it's actually not bad. Because I thought that it was like black. Like not black but like brown. Because you see how dark that looks? But then when you see it on here it's like a berry purple color. I just had to look it up on TikTok to like see if it's really like that. Because I was like why would they make a shade like this that literally looks like a bronzer. A very dark bronzer. Or a contour. I don't know. Just a bronzer. Very dark bronzer. Um, but yeah. I was a little confused but it actually is pretty. It's a, like, berry color. I think that this would look, like, a little bit better on darker skin tones, though, personally. It's, like, all right on me. I don't know. I heard that you're supposed to apply it with your fingers, so. Even though I already used the brush, but, like. Now, for my PR for the day, we have Shroom Skincare. They sent me over their serum. I think that they only make one thing, actually, but look at how adorable this packaging is. Like, I love this color. This, like, I don't know. It looks just, like, white on camera, but, like. 
I don't know how to explain it. It's just like pretty. I know it looks white on camera, but it's not really white. Um, so here it is. There was also a little note there, but I already took it down. So very cute little wrapping. Some packing peanuts in there. Oh my god, this is their serum. I believe that this is the only that I actually like the only item that they sell. Hopefully they'll make more in the future. But yeah, that's what it looks like. This is their mycelium glow brightening serum. It's made with mushroom. Um hold on. They I think that they gave me a little paper that says what it is made with. Or I can't find it right now. But it has like mushroom stuff in it and then I believe that it has vitamin C in there so it's meant to brighten and also apparently you can um, add it to areas where you have dark spots and it will brighten them or you can put it all over your face for a nice glow. So let's see what it looks like out of the packaging. This is it. I want to smell it. I wonder if it smells like mushrooms. Okay, let's see. There's rose hip oil. Rose hip. I never know how to pronounce that. Like, is it like rose hip? Rose hip? It's most interesting. Let's read a little bit of the ingredients. Seed oil. Watermelon seed oil. Ooh. Sunflower seed oil. This looks good. Okay. So. Yeah, I'm excited to try this out, and I will let you guys know if I think that it did, like, anything to my skin. Yeah, it's cute. That's the brand. I will link their website, like, down below, or their, like, socials. But, yeah, that's it all up close. I think it's cute. It looks actually really good, and the ingredients look nice, so I'm excited to try it. And, yeah, that was that for day four, and I did try to keep it a lot smaller we're at like six minutes and 30 seconds right now to be honest not too bad anyways i will see you guys at day four day four hey guys it is day four but it's also like kind of day five let's just say day five because it is actually friday day four is supposed to be thursday but since this video has been quite long so far i just decided to combine day four and five together so yeah, yesterday I did not open a package, and I just saved it for today. So I'm excited to show you guys. I have two packages, one from yesterday, one from today. So let me show you guys what I got. I'm actually really excited for these two, because this is a brand that I really liked. So first, on Thursday, a package from Iris and Romeo came. I'm not sure if you could see it, but like, they are like the the best brand for like clean beauty like their stuff is actually like so cool like if you look on their instagram their stuff looks so nice and i was just like obsessed with everything that i saw and all their shades look so pretty and everything so um let me show you guys what they sent me i'm so excited i think that there's i don't know how many things they sent me it's a cute box i love that color so let's see very cute you guys has like a little well big message over there cute I cannot wait. I hope that I can work with them more because their stuff is actually like so cute you guys I'm actually so excited and their stuff looks like such good quality <laughs> Um, And I'm not gonna call names like brand names out before But I will say that sometimes I have gotten PR from brands and their quality was just not good like Sometimes the quality is not good, but this is a really good quality brand um, and if the quality is not that good, then sometimes, you know, I'll say something because I don't want you guys to be buying stuff that's not worth your money. Unless it's very cheap, then I understand. But if it's expensive and the quality is bad, then I will say something about that. Um, but most of the time, it's just like the packaging that's bad on those. Not the product inside. The product inside is fine, but just the packaging sometimes is very, like, poor quality. But these, I know that these are nice because my friend actually owns some stuff from here. And I tried it when I went to her house. And I was so excited to receive this package now. So, let me show you guys. Looks like we have four things in here. First of all, this little guy, um, Iris and Romeo Brow Up Thickening Brow Balm. Ooh. I'm already wearing something on my brows. It's just like a clear brow gel, but I might try it, like, on top. Okay, here we go. Their packaging is really cute. I always struggle to open stuff. Okay. Here it is. Iris and Romeo Brow Up. It would be really pretty if they made it like the same color as the packaging because their packaging is so cute. That's what it looks like. It has like little, what are they called? The 
the like fibers to like make your brows like more fluffy i think i think i'm gonna try it just like a bit this looks like it's about my shade okay i know that you're supposed to brush them up and then down but my brows are like not moving right now because i'm using like the kaja beauty like brow thingy but i can already tell that i'm gonna like this it is very thick oh my god i just got it in my hair should have moved my hair out of the way That looks good. I do think that it is my color. I like that. It's pretty. Okay, so I'm going to use this tomorrow when I get ready, and I will tell you guys what I think. Um, but so far, I think it looks pretty cool. Then, oh my god, this big one. We went smallest to biggest. So, this is the Iris and Romeo Weakened Skin Ooh, um, SPF 50 Vitamin C Plus Glow. So, this looks really exciting. Oh. Oh my god i love the packaging the packaging all has like kind of different vibes like you see like pink and then white but, like i get it because it's like this is i mean not pink what the heck purple white but this is purple this is white so yeah i just want to like try this i know that i'm wearing makeup but i kind of want to just try it on my face this looks really cool the packaging is so pretty it is a little tinted if you could see that there's a bit of a tint so i'm just gonna try it on my hand for now Ooh, it looks very glowy. It also seems like it gives, like, a little bit of a tan. Like, my hand looks a little more... I don't think that you guys can see it on camera, but my hand looks a little bit more, like, tan. Guys, don't mind my hands. They're very ugly. Um, but, yeah, my hand looks, like, tan because I am very pale. So this would be nice. I'm excited to try this out. This is, like, something that I'm really excited for. But then we have... As you guys know, I love blushes so much. Like, I have so many blushes. That's the most of something that I have in my makeup collection. I just have the most blushes. So, this is their Ceramide Multi Balm, and this one's cool because it is for cheeks, lips, and face. And what they mean by end face is that their darkest shade is, like, pretty much, like, brown, and you could actually use that one for contour. So, that's pretty cool. Um, this is the shade that I got. It is the color, I think it's on the bottom, Rosy Glow. This one looks really pretty, so we're going to try it out. It looks very glowy. I can already see it's going to be, like, nice and glowy. I think... Um, the other package that I got, I think that that also has, like, a blush in it, so, yeah, I'm just gonna try it on, like, one side, and then we can try the other brand's one on the other side. They're both, like, six, I believe, but, yeah, okay. Let's try that out. I don't know, that might be too much. I have no idea how pigmented these are, so we will see. I'm not sure if I should blend this out with, like, a beauty blender or a brush, I'm going to just do a beauty blender because I feel like a beauty blender can be used for everything. Let's see if it says on the box what you can... I don't know. But this color is pretty. I could see that it's pretty. Oh, so it is very light coverage because, as you can see, I did a pretty good amount. and. But I understand that because this is supposed to be like a very like light, natural no makeup makeup type of brand and i like that a lot i always try to do those looks but like don't mind the way that i'm aggressively blending it in i'm just trying to like find the way that's best to blend it in but it is a really pretty color and i like it it's cute yeah this is the shade rosy glow i'm not sure what other colors they have but this is pretty cool should we try it on the lips you guys Okay, there we are. I think I'm going to try it on the lips. Ooh. It. Oh my god, I added a, l a little much. Oops. Am I the only one that's like, okay, everybody, my mom, whenever I walk out of the bathroom, my mom's like, literally, why do you take so long getting ready? Because I take, like, 40 minutes, and then she's like, how do you take so long getting ready? And then, like, the only thing that looks like it's changed about you is your lashes, because they just look, like, more, like, darker. And I was like, I could, like, kind of see that, but, like, I don't know. But, and then I was like, okay, then how about I just, like, do my mascara? And then I'm like... But no, like, I want concealer, because, like, my under eyes might be dark that day. And then I'm like, 
No, because I want, like, blush, because otherwise I'll be too pale. But then I also want, like, highlighter, because if I'm going to have blush, why not highlighter? But of course I need something on my lips. And then my brows are going to be crazy. If I don't, like, style them. That's my problem. I just have to keep on adding. Because if I, you know, I don't want to just, like, wear mascara. Like, I'll probably look the same either way, but, like, I don't know. Okay, now we have the Iris and Romeo Power Peptide Lip Balm. This is the last thing in here. I'm excited to try this. This is in the shade Peony. That sounds pretty. I love Peony, like, colored stuff. It's pretty. I hope that this is hydrating because my lips, you can't really see it, like, on camera because... I put, like, a lip scrub earlier, and it kind of got rid of it, but my lips were so chapped that literally, like, it cracked and it started bleeding. So, we will see. Very, very pink color. Doesn't really smell like much. It kind of just smells like a very, like, faint flower scent. I'm going to use this, like, Laneige lip mask brush to, like, scoop it out. That's how it looks after I scooped it. Very pink, but I like that. It's pretty. It is very hydrating and, like, nourishing. I like it. It's really, like, smooth feeling. I will also link their website down below. Every single brand that I show, I will link their website or their socials if I can find them. So cute. It kind of like also gives your lips like a glossy effect. I really like this. I feel like my mom will look very good in this color. My mom already told me that if they send me this one, she's going to be using it. So I was probably going to steal this from me because my mom uses all of my makeup. You guys, she always uses my makeup, but it's I'm fine with it because I have a lot of makeup. Trust me, there's enough to go around. Like if you guys have seen my videos. Every single day I show an up, like, a new product. And, like, at least sometimes, like, yeah. I kind of have a problem with Sephora. Not really Ulta. I don't really shop at Ulta. But Sephora got me good. And you know what really convinces me to buy from Sephora? Oh, shoot. It's already been 10 minutes. Shoot. Um, the, like, free gifts. So they go, like, oh, with a $25, you get this as a free gift. Like, oh, my God, yay. I need that like the other day it said spend $25 get a free merit travel size blush and I was like oh my god a merit blush I've been wanting that so I placed my order and I bought the New York concealer and it's not even like actually maybe it is my shade I don't know I'm wearing it today how do you guys think it looks but yeah now we have a package this is from iMethod Beauty it feels like there's one thing in here which is weird because um okay this brand I dm them a while ago or no i don't think i dm them i'm not sure what happened but a while ago i was gonna work with them and they said okay we would love to send you our eyeliner and our brow stamp thingy and i was like okay but i don't really like wear eyeliner like if you guys know i i don't wear eyeliner at all so i was like sorry but like i don't really wear eyeliner like do you guys have anything else and they're like no that's all we have available but then i reached out to them later i forgot that it was the same brand and i was just scrolling through instagram and i was like oh their blush looks really nice i'll reach out to them and yeah, they said, like, the same thing. Like, we would love you to try our eyeliner. Da -da -da -da. And I said, I don't wear eyeliner. Do you guys have anything else? And they said, you could look at our Amazon store. And I found the blush and a brow wax that looks really cool. So I told them. So they said, like, yeah, we will send you those, too. But it feels like there's one thing in here. Maybe they're, like, coming in different packages. If they are, then I will make another video for the brow wax. But this is the blush that they sent me. It's in a little tin. And what I like about this blush, okay, so this is the shade. What shade is this? Oh, O2 Hot Cherry Sheer Red. That's what it looks like. And what I like about this is that, okay, one side is the blush. This is the shade of the blush. Pretty. I thought that it would be more red, to be honest. But it's actually, like, I like this more than, like, if it would be more red, you know? And then what I really like about this is that it has a brush on the other side. So, you know, like, it's pretty cool. And I think that these are pretty affordable, The um, this brand, Eye Method Beauty. So, yeah, but if they do end up sending the brow wax, I, I feel like this is going to be pigmented. So, I think I just messed up really bad. 
So they do end up sending out the brow wax. Um, ooh. I just have to say real quick, this brush is very harsh. Like, it's really nice to, like, have, like, on it, but it feels a little bit harsh. Like, I'm trying to be, like, honest, you guys, because I want to be honest with you guys about all these brands, if I get it for free or not. The brush is a little harsh, but the color is really pretty. It, like, for me, it would just be better to blend it with, like, a beauty blender, because this is a very harsh brush, and I feel like, I don't know, but... It is a really pretty color. I think I might have added a little much, or actually, you know, that might be just fine. Let's add a little on the nose. It looks like contour placement. I don't, I don't even wear contour, but I tried a while ago and it did not look good on me. I think I was just doing it wrong. Because I do not know how to use contour. I've been trying to do bronzer recently, and I know that you couldn't really tell, but it's because I, I went very light on bronzer today because, like, before I like did this makeup like I was trying to do my makeup and I really like messed up so I had to like restart it and it was because of the bronzer and also my concealer was looking really cakey I don't know why it was just looking bad and then I used the same exact concealer and now it looks like fine and smooth so no it's weird I think it's because before I used my like Neutrogena base under but I like my Neutrogena base so maybe I just like added too much of it okay that's what it looks like so this is Iris and Romeo this is um I'm um, method beauty. I think you could tell which one's more pigmented. They're both like a good amount of pigmented though. I don't They're both kind of like similar looking. You see kind of similar packaging. But um yes, yeah, so I will link all these shops down below. And before we leave, I just want to say thank you to all of the brands that sent me stuff. Like I appreciate it so much and I love reviewing everything. Um so thank you so much. I loved everything. And yeah, once again, all the brands will be tagged below. And comment down below if you guys like videos like this, because I'll be down to do it. But also, I don't want brands to get mad at me if I take like a week to make the video for them. But I'm still going to make a YouTube short for them, okay? But anyways, um, yeah, so I will see you guys later. And comment if you guys like videos like this. Maybe I should do this like once a month, kind of like what I get in a week as PR, you know? Okay. So that is it. Before we leave, make sure to like, subscribe, and smash the notification bell and make sure to go support these brands follow them purchase from them if you want you don't have to but check out their shops and stuff because they have some really cute stuff all of these brands um so yeah i will see you guys later bye